Hello and welcome to the GT Hiring Solutions presentation on how to apply for apprentice financial supports. For registered ITA apprentices attending trades training in the province of British Columbia. Let's begin with an overview of the steps to apply for apprentice financial supports. The first step will be to complete the application on the Apprentice online portal. You will then wait 24 to 48 hours for the EI reference code to be generated by the system. You will then log in in order to retrieve the EI reference code and once you have the code you will then complete the application for regular EI on the Service Canada website. To begin the process you can navigate to the website on the left hand side of the screen or you can simply Google Apprentice Online Portal and click on the top link. On the first page you will click on the blue button that says Apprentice Online Portal. On the following page please click on the blue button that says Apply Here. Next you will see a map and you will be asked to select your training institution. Once you have selected the correct training institution please select Go and then continue my application. On the following screen, you will scroll to the bottom of the page and click on the green Start button. Next, you will be asked whether you are working on a personal computer or on a public computer. Then you will indicate whether you have an existing basic BCE ID account or whether you do not have a basic BCE ID account. If you do have a BCE ID account, please click Login and Continue. If you do not have a basic BCE ID account, or if you have forgotten your previous basic BCE ID account, please choose Create BCE ID and Continue. On the following screen, you will click on the button to visit the BCE ID website. You will then be directed to the BCE ID website and you will begin the process to obtain your BCE ID by clicking on the button that says Register to get this BCE ID account. Please follow the prompts in order to create your basic BCE ID. Once you have completed the process and entered all of the required fields, please note down your username and password. You will be required to use these when you log in to retrieve your EI reference code. Once you have noted down your username and password, please click on the yellow button Proceed to Online Service Subscription. You are now ready to complete the Apprentice Training Supports application. Please ensure that you complete all 10 sections. At the end, you will be required to enter your social insurance number agree to the terms and conditions, and submit your application. After you have submitted your application, you will wait 24 to 48 hours and then go to the website apply.workbc.ca in order to log in using the username and password you created for your basic BCE ID. Once you have logged in and clicked Next, on the history screen, you will then see your submissions page. Attached to your most recent application, you will see a blue button that says EI Reference Code. Please click on this button in order to view the 16-digit code that you will require to be eligible for EI as an apprentice. Please note that the EI Reference Code is time and location specific. If you apply more than four weeks before you start class, this code will become available to you through this process four weeks before you begin your course. Thank you very much for your time and attention. If you are interested in further information regarding becoming an apprentice or pursuing trades training in the province of British Columbia, please visit the WorkBC website at www.workbc.ca. On behalf of GT Hiring Solutions, thank you very much and have a great day.